special. This is the one that I. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Hannah. Today I'm gonna go to the Apple Store and I'm gonna get a Mac. I've decided that I'm gonna go with the Mac Mini Pro with an M2 chip because it's a little bit more affordable than the bigger Mac Studio and also it will perform to the extent that I need the computer for. I usually just use it for school and then video editing. Right now I use my MacBook Air, which is really not the most ideal computer to use for editing, image editing, things like that. So I wanted a computer that actually can support that. This is my first computer I'll ever have. Like I've never bought like a like an actual computer computer before. Let's go to get my new Mac. Oh my god, I'm actually so excited. with me my mac mini i decided to go with the mac mini the m2 512 gigabyte because there was a mac mini m2 pro that one was way too advanced for what i needed it for we're gonna unbox it i also got i'm just like hungry poke bowl from hula i was like the next in line and i still didn't know what i wanted so i just impulsively just picked whatever i saw on the menu so i got the peruvian bowl with salmon i honestly don't think i've ever had the peruvian before it looks pretty good oh my god it smells so good i like ate very like light for my breakfast this morning so i'm actually like really hungry here is the Mac mini. We're gonna unbox it. Oh my god, I'm actually like freaking out. This is my first computer I've ever had. I'm so proud to just say like I bought it myself too. I had to turn in my old iPhone 11 Pro and then I couldn't turn in my iPhone 8 because it was like too damaged. It's like... Wait, hold on. I might just have allergies, but this smells like an apple. <laughs> like it smells fruity. Am I stupid? It smells like like crisp apple scents from like Bath and Body Works, like for the fall season. There's no way. Oh, I just got my makeup on it. Anyways, I'm gonna pull open this tab. Oh, it's actually like pretty thin. The box looks a lot bigger than it actually is. And then inside the box, it comes with power cord. I remember people used to say that there's like hidden stuff inside the box and like they would like rip it apart, but there really isn't. I love taking these apart though. This is so satisfying. One of my friends is like a packaging engineer and basically he does stuff like this. Like he engineers the packaging of like products. So it's kind of funny for me to imagine like him having to like put something like this together. That's actually like really cool. I'm so sad to get my fingerprints on it. My hands are sweaty and it's getting like, but when I get nervous, I start sweating and I don't want like my sweat prints on it. Okay, wait, let me, let me just grab something real quick to fix that. Okay, we're back. I have my Ritzia gloves on. It says Mac Mini on the bottom. Okay, there's all the ports here. We're gonna clean up my desk and set it up. Here is what it looks like when I have eaten Poke Bowl. I don't have like a good setup because I don't game or anything like that. I've like always wanted to get my own computer that isn't like Excuse my luck. Press the return key. I was not expecting her to talk. I'm actually so excited. And I can finally use my MacBook for like school or when I'm on campus and I can finally have my own computer for home. Hello, good morning. We're gonna go to Best Buy today because there is a camera that I've been wanting to get. I had a Best Buy gift card, so I wanted to use it to get a new camera. This is my current one, my cute little Sony ZV-1. It is supposed to be like small and versatile, but I feel like it's still too a little, I shouldn't say it's hefty because it really isn't. It's because of the wide angle lens that makes it kind of hefty. It, realistically, it's like this small. My old camera before this was a Canon G7X, but I like this one so much better. It has this and it's just, I don't know. I just like the way that it films better and it has better product recognition. So there's two cameras that I had my eyes on. It was the camera Canon's PowerShot V10 and the DJI Pocket 2. So I'm pretty sure the Best Buy in Canada doesn't have the PowerShot V10, which is the one that I wanted to get. If they have the PowerShot V10, I might be getting that one because that's the one I really wanted to get. For now, let's head on over to Best Buy. <laughs> this is the one that I have. This is a ZV1. They didn't have the two cameras I was looking for at Best Buy, so we're gonna go to McBain camera. It's a much further walk, but they have one of the models I can at least test. Mm -hmm. I have my heart set on this one. I will say this is very. What is this? Really? 
I just got back home and I have the Canon PowerShot V10 camera in my hands. A couple of things about this camera, it literally is like the size of a credit card. Like it's so small. But basically I've actually just paid for the camera. I bought it completely. And what we're gonna do is I have 15 days to use this camera, play around with it, see how I feel about it. And then I can return it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna play around with this camera for like the next two weeks or so and kind of really decide which one I'm leaning towards. The Originally I really had my heart set on this camera, but after testing around a dupe version of the DJI Pocket 2, I was like, you know what? The Pocket 2 actually isn't terrible. I'm meeting my friends at the park and I'm gonna be bringing this little camera with me. I'm gonna test out the audio quality, test out just the video quality, everything. And what I really like it is it has this little tripod so it can kind of like stand like this. If you wanna lean it forward more, you can turn the little tripod around like this, like that. Hello. Your other one was so it's like it wasn't even that big, but like it's kinda inconvenient, right? Like fall and fish. Sounds so good. Oh, thank you, Anna. And then custard cream. This is Melon's first time having thing soup. <laughs> yeah. Got the pineapple in there, yeah. The same reaction. Dude, your head is shaking. <laughs> oh my goodness. Alright. Oh no, it's okay, it's okay. <laughs> okay, so I just got back home. I took a shower. Um, yeah. Yeah. It's probably my closet over there. My sister wanted to go get happy hour somewhere. So we're going back out to eat. I just want to show you guys a quick view of the sunset. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like pretty it's colors. So nice. It's so pretty and it's so nice. So we ended up at Chianti's. It's like this cute little Italian restaurant on the corner of like the very busy street here. So there's like really pretty lights all around. There's like no one else here also, like the only one. Oh my god, there's so many mosquitoes. I got this salmon special. It was like salmon and like creamy dill sauce, which is what sold me. And I got spinach noodles with like this pesto creamy sauce. Creamy dill sauce is so good. Mm. Oh, this salmon is crispy. Oh my god. Today is Monday and I have to go into the office today. During the summer, I work a full-time job as a digital consultant. So even though it's a remote job, I still have to go into the office two days out of the week. My days are Mondays and Thursdays. So today's Monday, we're gonna go get ready to go into the office. The other day when we went out to the park, I think that day made me just realize how much of a homebody I've been the past like couple weeks. I got at least like 10 mosquito bites. That was the first time I've gotten bit all summer. It's like mid-August and I haven't gotten a single mosquito bite the whole summer until that day. Like I literally just don't go outside anymore.
I just got home from work. I have some leftover food from lunch earlier that I'm just gonna eat while watching a show. But I printed out some shipping labels earlier because I have to return, return. I have to return one of the internet equipment that I had from my old apartment. There's a Rexall right across the street, which is like just a pharmacy, like a drugstore. I'm just gonna go drop off my package there. I don't know about you guys, but like I have to wash something while I eat. Like it's such a bad habit and it's actually like a really unhealthy habit. I could be a lot more productive if I didn't wash something while I eat, but it's just like, it's just something I've always done. But I feel like a lot of people wash stuff while they eat. That slogan's just temporary, right? Oh, I don't work under Brad. Sunset just reflecting off the glass here. My sister wants to go to Tiger Sugar because a new one opened up and she wants to get bubble tea. So I guess we're getting bubble tea now. Looking like this, bruh. So we went to the Tiger Sugar. My sister got vanilla black tea latte with boba and cream mousse. And then I got the strawberry mochi milk. And it comes with mango jelly and aloe jelly. And I asked them not to put it in there. And they even wrote no mango or aloe jelly. They wrote it on here, but they still added in the jelly. It's like pretty new and they seem kind of busy. So I'm just like, whatever. Okay, it's good, but it's way too sweet with all the jellies in it. Let it go, all the boots are like, whoa Thing I go, cause you're over I see, I see, I see. and you're the middle now, girl Yeah, girl, you 